Hey guys, t shirt 9 and today I'll be unboxing the new high grade 120 scale Gundam Barbatos, the new lead mobile suit in brand new 2015 anime series Mobile Suit Gundam Iron Blood Orphans. Uh, this is the premiere kit in the new new line. In the time of recording, uh, Mobile Suit Gundam Thunderbolt was released less than a few days, less than a few, little, little less than a day ago. So I need to watch so watching this, but this is about the Barbatos. Let's get on with this unboxing. So you can see a nice picture of the Barbatos, you know, with the word I'm going to dub the Corn Cob Mace. There's this big blade part that thing does look like a corn on the cob. On the side you can see some action poses with in in his first form, the in using the blade. The mace and the customized parts from the uh, Schwab greys and the regular greys. This side you can basically see just you know it's number one in the series. Um, yeah, this side you can basically see stock photos, uh, character on the uh, yeah, little, sorry on the pilot Mikazuki, and the story, and then it sells for a thousand yen like the Schwab greys and the greys Kai which I've already unboxed. And same thing, it's still number one series, so let's get on with this. So let's see what the Barbatos has in store for us here on T-Show 9. So, um, yeah, so we've got the A1 runner. See the cut, so you can see the cut marks. So this is, this is there's two A runners. So you can see you've got mainly, just mainly all your inner frames, especially with their ankle rock and tilt. And especially this kit does have complete does actually have a complete in a frame. I'll talk about the in frame once once again to review which will be happening in a listen in a few weeks. It's the A2 and it still completes with that uh, you know um inner frame, so you've got the arms for the optional weapon packs. And you've got the parts of the mace and the blade. So the blade comes in one piece whilst the mace comes in two pieces. Yeah. They're done with this nice, good grayish plastic. Looks fantastic. The B runner, I'm not going to say much. It's just com completes all your white parts. Just stuff for the thrusters. Yeah, everything that's been white on this kit that isn't done by use of stickers is on this runner. So you can see those nice shoulder pads. Uh, yeah, just completes everything for your completes everything that isn't white that, that doesn't use a lot of stickers. Your D runner, which contains four pieces for the feet, the uh, crotch, and the uh, red piece, the red piece that goes underneath his foot chin. Your E runner, can, which is very little, like the uh, well red, or it's just stuff for the parts for the uh, you know top of the chest and parts that go underneath the arms. Your C, oh sorry, and this is the C runner, sorry I didn't go in order, that's my fault. And all it contains part, all your part, yellow parts. Um, so it's up for that very nice v fin, one of the best v fins I've seen in like years. Um, yeah, parts for that to go on the, on the knee pads, the chest, everything that's going to be white, that's going to be yellow on this, is in this runner. So your poly caps include uh, PC002, nothing. New that you haven't seen before, just you know, seen these with these pilot caps on you know, hundred uh, no high grades before and possibly in the future. Your foil stickers, uh this is a large inclusion of four stickers, but all you contain parts to the uh, little knee pad the inclusions that go on the on the knee pads and shoulder pads, stuff for the, the size of the thighs. Um, stuff on the on the side skirts, um, on, on the th on the top of the thighs, and the boosters and the eyes. And this, this is the instruction manual. Pretty bit simple. It's your pilot, the uh, picture of the four four Baltos, and you know Mikazuki in a mobile worker, which I absolutely looks fantastic. Um, so going in. 
so you basically can see, see only only five pot of all the parts here, only five polycaps will not be used. So yeah, you don't really need those and you can basically start you want to basically start with the chest, the right arm, the left arm, the left leg, right leg, uh, waist and the weapons you can and you can basically swap out because you get three arms. Uh, two one for two for the fourth form, one for the first one which will include the gauntlet. And you can you can customize these with the great with the, with some of these other kits that we, that, we, that have been already released. So that has been my look at the uh, one 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 point four scale high grade Gundam barbecue. Um, any questions on if I will get the one one hundred scale barbecue? It's not going to be a certainty. I believe that. And if I get one kit, it has to be one singular kit. Now, since I got the one twenty forty four scale barbitos, it will be out no about the yes, in the one twenty hundred scale barbitos. Then, but the only good thing about that is definitely you get open palms, you get a small sport cannon, and the eyes will not be you know is done by use of a singular green piece of plastic, which. It's new for a both high grade, no for a no grade or master grade. When perfect or it's not as perfect grade, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So please like, comment, subscribe. I'll do a I'll do a full uh, picture gallery um, on my Twitter account. So please look forward to that. Um, yeah, if you want to follow, it's National Edge Capital in Capital, all one word. Um, please, um, just, yeah, please, you know, just follow me on Twitter, I'll do any little, um, notifications about anything. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Please look forward to, please look forward, because the next unboxing will be the Bayer Allen Custom. See you guys next time. You guys rock. I'll see you later.